What's going on friends? Welcome to the first scrap with me video and I am so excited that I finally kind of finessed my way to this camera setup. I wish I could take a picture and show you guys but anyways we're gonna go right into it. So here we have my 2018 scrapbook. It is currently in progress and I have some finished pages here. We are left off in the 29 rooms event and I have a few more pictures that I need to scrap which I will be showing you guys today. These are my current favorite embellishments and they are stickers. I love working with stickers because they're so easy. You don't need any glue stick. Just pick something and put it on. Some other favorite embellishments are washi tape. Again, they're really easy to work with. You can get a whole pack of these at Michael's for a really affordable price. And if you get a coupon, it's even better. So I work with half size pages. I think there's an official term for it. I'll look it up and put it in this video. But all I do is fold a paper in half and cut it. I like working with this size because I feel like I don't get overwhelmed by the design and having to use all my supplies. I actually started scrapbooking with 12 by 12 pages and that was just way overwhelming. I felt like I spent more time picking out supplies and designing it than actually doing anything. So after I have my pictures positioned the way I want it, I go through my supplies and I pick out papers that I think will go well with the theme. Since this whole museum 29 room thing was very colorful, I pulled out a lot of rainbow, florals, colorful papers. From here on out, you guys are just going to see me lay everything down. I'm going to be moving the papers around, picking out some stickers, even repositioning the pictures, but it's just all trial and error and however you think it looks great. I know there are some technical aspects to designing, such as rule of thirds or color theory, but I don't really keep those in mind when I'm designing. I just pull the supplies that I think look great and glue them down. Sometimes, even after I've glued something down, I'll rip it off because a different embellishment changes the layout, but the great thing about scrapbooking is that it is very personal. So have fun, do not be intimidated by all the rules, and I'm just going to play the video, okay? I'm just going to fast forward through this. I hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys next time. 